Hi guys, NCWQ here, and I have y'all looking at John Hopkins Coronavirus COVID-19 Global Cases by Center for System Science and Engineering at John Hopkins University. And we're going to start with Florida and work our way up the East Coast. Florida has 76 confirmed cases, 3 deaths, and active 73. Georgia has confirmed 73, 1 death, and 72 active. South Carolina has confirmed 19, with 19 still active. North Carolina has confirmed 25, with 25 active. Virginia has confirmed 41, with 1 death, and 40 active. District of Columbia has confirmed 16, with 6 16 active. Maryland has confirmed 27 with 27 active. Delaware has confirmed 6 with 6 active. Pennsylvania has confirmed 47 with 47 active. New Jersey has confirmed 69, 1 death, and active 68. New York has now confirmed 613, two deaths, and active of 611. Connecticut has confirmed 23, with 23 active. Rhode Island has confirmed 20, with 20 active. Massachusetts has confirmed 138, with 137 active, and one recovered, thank God. New Hampshire has confirmed 7 with 7 active. Vermont has confirmed 5 with 5 active. Maine has confirmed 3 with 3 active. Alabama has confirmed 7 with 7 active. Louisiana has confirmed 77, 1 death and 76 active. Mississippi has confirmed 6 with 6 active. Alabama confirmed 7 with 7 active. Tennessee has confirmed 32 with 32 active. Kentucky has confirmed 18 with 18 active. Ohio has confirmed 26 with 26 active. Texas has confirmed 61 with 61 active. Arkansas has confirmed 12 with 12 active. Indiana has confirmed 16 with 16 active. Oklahoma has confirmed 4 with 4 active. Missouri has confirmed 4 with 4 active. Illinois has confirmed 64, 2 recovered, thank God, and 62 active. Michigan has confirmed 25 with 25 active. Kansas has confirmed 8 with 1 death and 7 active. Arizona has confirmed 12, 1 recovered, thank God, and 11 active. New Mexico has confirmed 13 with 13 active. Colorado has confirmed 101, 1 death, 100 active. Nebraska has confirmed 18 with 18 active. Iowa has confirmed 17 with 17 active. Wisconsin has confirmed 27, 1 recovered, thank God, with 26 still active. California has confirmed 368, 5 deaths, 6 recovered, thank God, and 357 still active. Nevada has confirmed 21, with 21 still active. Utah has confirmed 10, with 10 still active. Wyoming has confirmed 3, with 3 still active. <coughs> South Dakota has confirmed 9 with 1 death and 8 still active. Minnesota has confirmed 21 with 21 still active. 
And then people from the Grand Princess cruise ship have confirmed 21, with 21 still active. Wait, hold on. Um, where are you? North Dakota has confirmed one, with one still active. Idaho has confirmed four, with four still active. Montana has confirmed five, with five active. Idaho has four with four active. Oregon has confirmed 36 with 36 active. Wait, where are you? Washington State has confirmed 642 with 40 deaths, one recovered, thank God, and 601 still active. But, where the fuck is that? Hang on one second. I'm going to look at something statistically. New York has still 611, so Washington State right now has less than New York. Oh, I should be tiny. British Columbia, Canada has confirmed 73 with one death and four recovered, thank God, leaving 68 still active. Alberta, Canada has confirmed 39 with 39 active. What size are you? Saskatchewan has confirmed wow. two with two active. Manitoba, Canada has confirmed four with four active. Ontario, Canada has confirmed 104 with four recovered, thank God, and 100 still active. Quebec, Canada has confirmed 24 with 24 still active. Newfoundland and Labrador has confirmed one with one active. New Brunswick, Canada is confirmed two with two active. Prince Edward Island, Canada is confirmed one with one active. And I believe I got all of these here. Maine has three with three active. New Hampshire. Vermont has five with five active. Okay, now we're going to look at Mexico. Mexico has 36, one re four recovered, thank God, and 22 still active. I'm as big as the fish. Guatemala has confirmed one with one active. Hold on, I need to be smaller than this. Honduras has confirmed two with two active. Costa Rica has 26 with 26 active. Panama has 36 with one death and 35 still active. Colombia is 22 with 22 active. Ecuador has confirmed 28, two deaths, and 26 still active. Peru has confirmed 38 with 38 still active. Bolivia has confirmed 10 with 10 still active. Chile has confirmed 61 with 61 active. Argentina has confirmed 34, two deaths, one recovered, thank God, and 31 still active. Uruguay has confirmed four with four active. Paraguay has confirmed six with six active. Brazil has confirmed 151 with 151 active. French Guiana has confirmed five with five active. Suriname has confirmed one with one active. Guyana has confirmed one, one death, zero still active. Venezuela has confirmed two with two active. Trinidad and Tobago has confirmed two with two active. St. Vincent and Grenadines has confirmed one with one active. St. Lucia has confirmed one with one active. Martinique has confirmed nine with nine active. Guadalupe has confirmed one with one active. Antigua and Barbuda have confirmed one with one active. St. Bethlehemy has confirmed one with one active. St. Martin has confirmed two with two active. Rick, 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 you, you 
Virgin Islands has confirmed one with one active. Puerto Rico has confirmed three with three active. Dominican Republic has confirmed 11 with 11 active. Jamaica has confirmed eight with eight active. Cayman Islands confirmed one with one active. And Cuba has confirmed four with four active. And I don't think I missed any. Anyways, you guys, that's an update for the numbers today. I hope y'all are doing well wherever you are. There was one reported up here in Alaska. And that's one that's still active. The biggest terror that we did. So that's the first one. And that was reported, I believe, Friday night. Anyways, you guys, I hope y'all are doing well. Um, please be safe. Take care of yourselves and each other. Much love. You know, like the one